It is great to be with you virtually to discuss intellectual exceptionalities. For the following nine slides, we touch briefly on the essential aspects to know when we design learning instructions. But first, I wish to share with you about Lucy Larkham, an American teacher, poet, and author, who was one of the first teachers at Wheaton College in Norton, Massachusetts, teaching there from 1854 to 1862. During that time, she co-founded Rush Literary Magazine, a submission-based student literary magazine still published today. A quote from Lucy resonates with me, thinking about our journey to make a difference in a student's life. The selection is, I learned what, I, what education is, the penetrating deeper and rising higher into life, as well as making continually wider explorations the rounding of the whole human being out of safe and steady light. This makes the process an infinite one, not possible to be completed at any school. Indeed, it is a fantastic way to think about our contribution to another person's learning journey. Let's now look at what we will cover today. We will briefly revise what you all know about learning exceptionalities. The definition of idea, it's inclusive, diversity, equity, and accessible for learning exceptionalities, possible causes, and typical academic deficits. We will also review strategies to consider so we have fresh concepts in mind when we consider design instruction. Intellectual disability is significantly sub-avergence general intellectual functioning existing concurrently with deficits in adaptive behavior and manifested during the developmental period that adversely affects a child's educational performance. IQ of about 70 to 75 or below, deficits in adaptive behaviors present before age 18, adversely affected educational performance. And when we identify the characteristics, we will look at difficulties in learning, attention difficulties, academic difficulties, memory deficits, um, difficulties transferring and generalizing skills, speech disorders and language delays, deficits in social and personal skills, deficits in adaptive behavior skills. Now the causes, we look at knowledge of the role of genetics and chromosomal disorders as implications for the prevention and treatment of intellectual disabilities and genetic counseling for potential parents. Environmental factors that occur prenatally perinatally and postnatally can result in biological or medical problems that affect the individual's growth, development, and functions. Examples is rubella, uh, anoxia, and encephalitis. Psychosocial factors such as family poverty, homelessness, inadequate parent skills, and lack of early intervention services may contribute to intellectual this abilities rather than be a direct cause. Now, if we look at the joy of planning, so we reduce the, ch the chances of making errors by the students. That's efficiently implemented technologies, direct, explicit, clear objectives with advanced organizers, what demonstrations to help think about loud, allowed guide, guided practice, Think about the design of the task, analysis to move from simple to complex for specific skills. Plan for a lot of repetition and examples in the presentation. Plan for opportunities for independent practice. Emphasize the analysis and application of prompts. Incorporate generalization before, during, and after instructions. Now, when we strategize for positive impact, we look at the learning sequence, consider designing learning moments in a scaffolding process of difficulty, recognizing recall and reconstruction levels. Presentation and practice, a prompt is an additional stimulus or cue to increase the possibility of a correct response for the student. 
generalization. In 2012, uh, Kregel emphasized that generalization needs to be in various settings or across a set of related behaviors. Therefore, strategize to incorporate information before, during, and after the design so students can make it their own. Inclusive service learning scholars since 2004 have encouraged students to apply what they learn through community servers. Therefore, training you plan gives students the skills to use it in the community. Now, video presentations rather than a printed presentations with closed captions that require reading, uh, cultural movies, documentaries, video self-modeling using devices such as a phone to show the application of what students learn. They can use podcasts, software that makes the mouse pointer more visible, or an expanded keyboard with large keys and more spacious overall. Collaboration technologies incorporate inclusive lear service learning. And then community reference instructions. For instance, a eBuddy. Whether a student is participating in general curriculum or not, self determination and self advocacy are reachable with the help of technology. Thank you for listening.